Our sponsor today is BetterHelp. What's BetterHelp? It's therapy done online and done right, okay? Whether you're hot, cold, all right, whether it's fall, winter, summer, spring, whatever it is, it doesn't matter the time. BetterHelp is here for you. It's so easy to get caught up in what everyone else needs from you and never take a moment to think about what you need from yourself, all right? Like when you're pouring out and pouring love and getting all what you need to other people, they're not giving you all what you need back to yourself, okay? So make sure you tap in with BetterHelp today. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and switch therapists anytime for no additional charge, okay? That's better help, okay? Betterhelp.com slash trap house today to get 10% off your first month. That's better H-E-L-P dot com slash trap house. With Chime, there's no monthly fees, no minimum balance, and no deposit required to become a member. So what are you doing? Tap in with Chime A-S-A P. All right. So sign up for Chime checking account today to link your paycheck. It only takes two minutes and doesn't affect your credit score. Get started at Chime.com slash trap. That's Chime.com slash trap. OK. Chime is a financial technology company, not a bank. Banking services and debit card provided by the Bank Corp Bank N.A. or Stride Bank N.A. members FDIC. Early access to direct deposit funds depend on payer spot me eligibility requirements and overdraft limits apply see chime.com slash spot me welcome to the trap get your dad welcome body the in the trap. back welcome to the trap get your dad welcome body the in the trap. back welcome to the trap tripping welcome better than slipping welcome to the trap but sometimes we tripping trap. welcome to the trap welcome to the trap where we joking rap Gut busting laughs, <laughs> hand slapping laps, Girl, slap it loud. get you through your day, you through your day. and it's free of cost. I'm so cheap. Don't you laugh too loud, no, no. don't get fired by your boss. Welcome to the comedy trap house. Welcome to the comedy trap house. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of the comedy trap house. I'm your host, Rome Green Jr. in the building. With me, I got Emmanuel. Yo, what's up? You know, we good. I got Cam. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I got a very, very special guest with us today. You've seen him on All Deaf Digital. You've seen uh, his shows, Dad Jokes. You've seen Great Taste. Uh, he's a great comedian, producer. We got Patrick Cloud in the building. Yo, what's up, brother? How you doing? What's, up, How you doing? Man? what's going on? <laughs> man, glad to have you in here, man. Thank you. Hey. Highest voice in the room by far. Not even, not even close. You guys did all your intros. I was like, you guys got what bass. It is. You know what we try to do. We you know, know. Yeah, you know. Jesus. Yeah. You know. Um, yeah, thank you for coming through, man. Uh, Thanks for having me. This is yeah. insane. Yeah, yeah. Hey, can I ask you a quick question? Of course. For dad jokes. Okay. What is the greatest joke you've heard thus far? Besides everything that Dorm Tamer did, but yeah. Yeah. you guys, <laughs> I, honestly, I feel like I got a pretty damn good. No, one. You're, was it the, the the ham? The ham. That's so come stu- on. It was so stupid. It's not the greatest. It's not the greatest. Like, what did the fat girl say to the pig? The, the ham. ham. <laughs> like, come on. That's not the greatest. Got one of the greatest. Always crazy. Got one of the greatest ones with TLC. Why didn't T Boz and TLC exfoliate her face? Because she ain't want no scrubs. Come on. That's a solid delivery. Definitely. That's a solid. That's a solid. Joe, I think the, the definitely when I was on camera, the best one I've ever heard um, was why why are black people so tall? Why? Because they're Negroes. Uh, come on. That's, solid. That's good. I, That's re- good. I tried my hardest to keep that in, and I lost. It. That's good. That was, that was from Kev on great. stage. That was that yeah. was, that was good. Shout out to Kev. Shout out to Kev. Just, it's just it, there's no fat on it. <laughs> there's no fat on it. Um, yeah, but uh, we're just gonna jump into this real quick. Uh, R.I.P. Pop Smoke. Uh, yeah. Died last week, uh, earlier last week. Yeah, I think uh, it was right after, uh, like the next day. Yeah I, think it was, yeah, I think it was the next day. 20. But twenty years old, man. So it's like, 20. you know, and I don't Young. know, you know, I don't be knowing what be going on behind the scenes and shit. But it, it just ain't, it ain't worth it. You know what I'm saying? Is so, it, is it they like, didn't have to kill him. I wonder if the yeah. statistics of rapper dying, yeah. like, have gone up. Rapper deaths. 
in, over the course of a year. Same. I feel like there's been like it's a lot three of, or four years. De- definitely. I mean, Nipsey yeah, was, was killed. X and, was killed. And then, well, Juice World, he that was. It's a either situation. a drug overdose Juice or killing. Juice Juice are we counting those? Over the, I, I yeah, guess I mean, you know you, you, you count you just tragic deaths. Yeah. There has been a lot. I, you know I don't know if it was it's like weird. that in the '90s. It seemed like there were few and far between. Yeah, yeah. Like when Biggie and Pac thing. That was back to back. Yeah, like that was shocking thing. Now it kind of feels like a regular, you know, school shooting. Yeah. Yeah. But um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know too much about. It. I knew that he was up and coming and stuff like that. But you know, you don't want to hear him do like that. He had a great that. sound. It's, it was really just the most disappointing thing was that he actually had like a really genuine New York sound. Yeah, he did. And mm. the problem that people are having with New York hip hop is a lot of uh, musicians are going down to Atlanta mm-hmm. to make it oh, because mm-hmm. it, yeah, it, yeah. New York uh, DJs aren't breaking new artists. Yeah, yeah. 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 So that's how like, Nicki got big. Yeah, that's yeah. how uh, and Atlanta just stays Montana. circulating new artists. Right. Like that's that's crazy how it's Atlanta weird does. No it. one's caught up by now. It's like yeah. Atlanta's been running <laughs> shit for like yeah, the last it's what 10, 10? 15? Yeah, they, I it, think it's still ever since now. Okay, they, they're so keeping it. No, we Atlanta, got Atlanta, Atlanta. I, don't, I don't think it's going anywhere else. Yeah, I don't think it was like, like, like not the, going back to West we're Coast. In the, or, we're in the internet age right yeah, now, yeah. right? Like yeah. everything blows up on a, the, the, on the internet. So it's like, why does it need to switch cities? You know, I what mean, is the, the need for the industry to I blow up anywhere those, else? Outside I don't know. Of it seems Atlanta. like those DJs, those local DJs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It Blowing all up comes the artists. That. Yeah. And then also, yeah. like Cam said a long time ago, Atlanta artists support Atlanta artists a lot. Like it's a it's a they support. Like they truly support each yeah. other. Where in New York is kind of separate. Everyone want to be the king. Atlanta's like, hey, you come, like, come on, come, with come me. in the yeah. studio, That's come so in the dope. studio. When Southern I went to Atlanta, Hot they played no main major artists on the radio. Like I learned about <laughs> yeah, so right. many people. Mm-hmm. Yes. I was just writing yeah. down stuff like Lil St- yeah, Young. Atlanta's who is this? Young yeah. Lil. Yeah. Okay. Atlanta's sure. a place where you go to the club and you like you think you're gonna hear artists you know. You like I don't, who's like who's this guy? I'm like and oh that's like, that's Craig from up the street. That's what I'm saying. Like what? Who is that? He's like oh that's me. Like that's that's you. That's the security of friends. When we lived in Atlanta, I didn't appreciate that as much. Yeah, Cause I would I, turn yeah. on the radio like after a while. I'd be like, "Who are yeah, these who, niggas yeah, on the radio?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. 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 Play Ti, yeah. you know. But but as we left and coming here, and when you just hear top forty on the radio, yeah, yeah. consistently, it's like Jesus Christ. Can yeah, I hear yeah. somebody new in this world? You yeah, because it's yeah. like there's certain cities like we're just like like I think I blame L. A. for this. L. A. is kind of just like all right, who's hot? We right. need to know who's hot, yeah. and then we'll listen to them. Yeah. <laughs> it's like an elitist yeah. type yeah. of thing. Yeah, and then for Atlanta, it's like they. It's such a homegrown grown culture. Really, right. south, the South too, because yeah, Charlotte's yeah. starting to act like that. Yeah, mm-hmm. uh, Houston's always been like that. Yeah. Texas yeah. has been dope like this. So. Yeah. I love going to New York and listen to the radio. Really? Do they, they they have good radio there. They, they do it. Yeah, true. They'll play a lot of their artists Caribbean as well. too. And they, they play I love New York. Radio. A lot of different stuff. Um, all right, uh, Emmanuel. Emmanuel's telling us about some grown man stuff this morning oh. about an ingrown hair Bro, situation. Right, just, We've just, all been there. It, honestly, I. It, it's in a place where I thought I would have had an STD if I gotcha. didn't know any better. You okay. know what I mean? Gotcha. And this is the worst sensation I felt in a while. And growing hair is like, not fun. It's like it right on my goddamn like crotch. Like okay, so and mm-hmm. it's just like it's it. I woke up one morning, it was yeah, like yeah. a little little bubble. Yeah, yeah a little bubble. And I'm oh, looking no. at it and I touch it and I go ooh ooh. <laughs> you <laughs> sore? Like, oh, there's nothing. <laughs> and my girl, she she's like ooh, let me pop it. What is up with the fascination and popping shit? And I'm shit? just like, I hate that. that I hate those it's videos. Weird. What is, what is, what, why? Why? She wants to see the pus or something? Yeah. Like, I, don't, I don't know. So that was just, you know, they a part of my squirm. weekend. Hmm? They want to yeah. see you squirm. She's trying to take your manhood. Right, don't, right, right. Don't let her, don't do, let that, her do that, man. Don't let her play with my booty. <laughs> don't let her play. pop my... What is play? What do you mean? Yeah. You know, just... Well, yeah, that's a... Isn't that a given? You like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did you try and was it trial and error? <laughs> like, listen, I'll let what you did that with the other hand. Let's play with my booty. Let's cross that out. <laughs> it was spirit fingers. He did spirit <laughs> fingers. <laughs> Very right, specific. You know, hands start creeping to your ass. Yeah. And you're, like, you're like, hey, 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 hey yeah. fuck out back there. But, uh, <laughs> But yeah, yeah, that was just a start. So it's just uncomfortable, weekend. I guess. Yeah, because uh, it, it's just not. I don't. I've had it right where I tie my belt. Exactly. That's oh, where. That's where. That, uh, like the not, waistline right oh, there. The boxer waistline. Oh, your boxer waistline. I even shave. Okay. Like right yeah. now, I'm like all natural. Okay. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's this one bump. That is just you beard it down below. Right you beard it down below. <laughs> you beard it but down y'all below. You hibernate for the winter. Right I'm hibernating for the winter. I'm hibernating for the winter. But you knew what it was right away. It wasn't like a scare. Yeah, yeah. I, I, you know what? I woke up and, you know, right now what's big is the coronavirus. So I'm just like, oh, yeah. fuck. <laughs> right. Yeah. For a quick second. Yeah, but then I was like, I looked at it and I was like, Can oh, you I'm get corona on you? <laughs> those are the shit that you can never take back. Web MD. You go to WebMD. Fucking pubic coronavirus. The pubic corona. You went to WebMD, looked at all the symptoms. Even your Google was like, what? 
yeah, yeah. <laughs> but what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> uh, but in an effort to, you know, clean up uh, my diet as well, yeah. I decided to go on a potato fast. All right, I'm going to put a pin in that right quick. All right. Oh, uh, what? Here's the thing. No, I know. I fully support this. Potatoes are versatile. Okay. They're most because versatile pot- vegetable ever. Potatoes will hold you down in whatever situation. I don't know if you know that. Oh, so you mean a potato fast, like only potatoes? You're only eating only potatoes. eating potatoes for weeks. This is interesting. Oh, Where'd you I get thought the you meant no more potatoes. No, yeah, only oh, potatoes. Yeah, now, we're, only now we're back on track. <laughs> it's so funny how he got more scared. Hold on, hold on. You giving up potatoes <laughs> over only eating potatoes? <laughs> I just when I think of potato fast, I think of like Ireland in the seventeen hundreds. Games in New York. <laughs> <laughs> How'd we get here? That's hilarious. That's <laughs> funny. So anyway. what, what made you do the uh, potato fan? Uh, one, I just wanted to switch up my diet, and I do think the ingrown hair played a part of it. You know, why Watch. do we get so scared? We get so I, scared. I, I just want to, you know, I <laughs> it really, it really a, is health. You know, yeah, I I've never heard of this fast. No, I've never heard of this fast. Yeah, it's supposed to be a new thing where you know all this shit is just getting annoying, man. You got the <laughs> it's a war on all health. meat diet. You got the all vegetarian. You yeah. got the and so this potato one's supposedly supposed to flush out your system, really, because potato is nothing but just nutrients. Starch. Bo- yeah, starch. Mm-hmm. But it's good starch. It's supposed to flush you out. It's supposed to... Really? Blase, blase. So, so for I'm, dinner, it's like a, a fat-ass right, potato right, right, on a plate? Let me be honest with you guys. Yeah, go ahead. Like, okay, I'm doing this with my girl. Okay, who's a healthy person? Well, I for so sure knew that. she started top. this. I told her. I, <laughs> she said she wanted to do something. Yeah. And yeah, I was yeah. like, okay, you know, I did hear uh, Kevin Smith, who is a, a you know, a director, oh, oh, yeah, a yeah, comic yeah. book nerd guy, yeah, yeah. did a, you know, those movies. Bob, so. Silent Bob. Silent, Silent Bob, Bob. Yeah, yeah. there you go. So he he did, he had a heart attack. and Recently. Yeah, uh, this is maybe last year or so. Oh, sure. oh, and, yeah. uh, you know, he had to change his diet up. It was high cholesterol, all the mm-hmm. shit. And the doctor told him to try this new... Uh, potato fast mm-hmm. and basically what? it's not fun okay because yeah, what yeah. you love about potatoes <laughs> when what you'll le- end up learning yeah. is that it's not that you love potatoes yeah. you love everything around it you love it deep sour fried cream. Oh, yeah. you like fried, the sour tater cream tater butter. you like tater tots yeah. butter ketchup all that all shit, that shit. but brown. when you take all of that away it's just a potato but you're just eating potatoes like apples just potato <laughs> literally <laughs> literally you just bake potatoes plain yeah. or you could you know uh i don't know boil it yeah and then you just eat it that's not some caveman that's not some caveman can't salt, no yeah. oil now, now it sounds like Ireland oil. in the 1700s not even healthy oil for real for real not, right? not even right? healthy oil black death in the not even healthy oil what you have not even healthy oil no no oil nothing no oil. Just, just straight just potato and water no that's, butter no nothing what? it really is like Ireland that's what I'm saying this sounds like war food no butter nothing and basically it's like an elimination diet you know what I'm saying let's say you have like your skin is kind of you know breaking out or whatever whatever problems you have you know, you eliminate everything in your diet except for one thing. And as you start clearing up or yeah, you yeah, start yeah. feeling better, whatever, whatever, you slowly start bringing back things into your diet. And it's supposed that to, like, interesting. you know, uh, I've, I've really never heard of this. potato. Yeah, it's supposed to be dope. I'll so, see. I'm so telling three you. Three times start going this week. What type of potato? I, I, got, I got potatoes in my, my what book What type of bag. potato? That's hilarious. You can only do white That's potato. That's hilarious. Potato. I have to see this. Can, can you get you your potatoes book bag? in your book bag? That's a yeah, cheap diet. No, you can't get That's your book bag. bag. <laughs> you, can't, you can't tell us you got potatoes in your book bag and not go get your book bag. Who just has potatoes? He just comes home for dinner like, honey, I'm home. All the kids come running. That's potatoes. A, that's a cheap. I forgot it's in the car. I'll show you. Oh, okay. That's you a hot potatoes in the car. Them shit's in there boiling. It's just Tupperware. It's just, <laughs> fuck. You didn't close the door. You close the door. Oh. Can you push that back? Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> um, okay. At least so, four more questions. Oh, yeah. <laughs> at least. Even more. <laughs> there you go. There we go. There so that, go. that was kind of like the start of my weekend. It's like, all right, I got to okay. start this prep. You started this Friday. China. Huh? You started this for all like time. I start. No, I'm starting this this today. Okay, starting first day. Actually, I'm going to hold you accountable at that. House. Yeah, yeah. Don't try to come to our house and no, cheat. No, yeah. I'm, not, I'm, try, I'm trying to. I think I'll what do it. What if it helps your hair growth? Will you keep doing it? Oh my God. He comes in with like full <laughs> full, full locks. And now he's going to okay. have a little plant. Okay, <laughs> hold on. Hold on. No, no, no. If they if say, I, if they if they say six months. months. Okay. If you only ate this diet, your hair will fully grow back. Would you do it? Six months? Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. What's do the that. what's the plan? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm grow dreads like you. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's the plan? Like, how, you. Any of you drive a Honda? No. No. Okay, thanks. Oh. We, somebody Thanks, was, Hannah. <laughs> <laughs> I think there was an illegal car up by 
Mexico. It's an illegal car. Illegal car. car? Oh, illegally Let's parked. Go. Right. <laughs> <It's from Mexico. laughs> it's it's car. Illegal park. <laughs> if the car is illegal, <laughs> we got a problem. But what you saying? Uh, uh, yeah, six months. He asked you six months. Would you? He said, "What's your plan if you was to do that?" Well, no. What's your plan? Like, how long do you plan on doing, doing it now? The, okay, now, yeah. yeah. I, I just plan on doing potato fast for a week right now. Okay. Oh, okay. And, okay. and okay. I might do two weeks depending on how I feel. Awful. But yeah, it's 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 gonna be tough. That's gonna be interesting. But if I could grow my hair back, I would I would definitely do that with potato fat. And then I'd find some way to try to like capitalize off that. Oh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. My I word. found the cure. You'd be the, yeah. you'd be the potato face, man. the potato <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. fast. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just be promoting that online. So yeah. nothing else? Nothing else. Not potatoes, water. And you guys so you no guys throwing throat, stuff nothing. out of your kitchen now? You said what? So you are like, are you like taking stuff out of your kitchen? So there's no, 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 no we're not going that far. I still keep some shit like. That. If you yeah, find that cure, back to yeah. Bosley would try to assassinate you. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah. They're trying to take me out, Major Corp. Oh, yeah. Major he Corp. found okay. his hand and all that. They're trying to hand. kill you. He's like, like out. He's using potatoes. He Murder get this Negro. Bald assassins. Right. Do, you know, do you know the stock for potatoes would go through the roof if you came out that it grew your hair? Back. Bald men would be Bro. in grocery stores all everywhere. Potato farmers would be like, it's happening. And in every nation. Smiling on the news, talking about yeah, I, you know I every just day slayer that's ball. <laughs> yeah, don't maybe you know down it in public. Oh, yeah. they're gonna buy some potatoes. Oh yeah, they gonna buy. Yeah, <laughs> they're yeah, gonna yeah, try. They gonna buy some potatoes. I have a question. Gonna try. I've always I've always wondered this. How are we still? Dropping new diets like brand brand new yes, diets like, are right? still coming out, <laughs> right? But we're working with the same foods. Ain't no new foods dropped. That's but I feel like the 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 food corporations have some type of deal with advertising companies where like we'll promote uh, your product in such and such year, and gotcha. you'll become the new like kale. Yeah. Wait, I never heard people talk as much about, about kale, kale literally blew until up. about 2013. Yeah, yeah. Blew up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I feel like kale there's good. always gonna be another. Product. Only kale we knew was with Keenan. Right, right. Avocados blew yeah. up. Now everybody's eating avocados. Brussels yeah. sprouts came Brussels out of nowhere. Everyone comes loves Brussels sprouts now. <laughs> so it's becoming and like quinoa. music. You know what I'm saying? You, yeah. It makes a comeback. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? Like you infuse the Brussels sprouts just, with a little bit of I just read there's a company in Chicago that's about to go on another war on meats. with a, they, about to, they got another plant-based meat that's not impossible, not beyond. Now it's uh, another one. That new about new I dude said, oh, on shit. the scene? So it's like. And they, it's like they're meat. taking over the block. <laughs> like it's like, oh no, nah, we we got to fence this. It's the infinity block over here. This is the beyond block. We got right. our own corner over here. And it's just like, man, this neighborhood's changing. Shut your fucking fake meat spoofing it. <laughs> you go to go to real burgers. Like, come on, man. Bro. Like, come on. You go to a grocery store. That's they saying Larry's out to get gentrified. <laughs> <laughs> This is some bull. <laughs> this is some bull. Fake meat is gentrifying <laughs> our communities. That's crazy, our man. meaty communities. The meaty communities. I don't get it. The last, Jesus um, Christ. the last diet before this one was the. Uh, paleo. Paleo. Yeah, That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like then, all meat or something like that. Yeah, it was like, like, this is what cavemen eat. I was like, cavemen? <laughs> was so they, find, they find excuses for each thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I don't know. Whatever it is, you know, now they're saying greens that, that grass. We talked about this on a podcast before. Oh, that the green, plant, that plants plant have, screen. Yeah, screen. Yeah, plant like, screen. I did. I really yeah. Did you see about that? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like, so, vegans lost their mind. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> hey, fuck the plants. I got vegans are jumping off buildings. <laughs> you gotta eat. The thought hilarious. of a turnip, like, ah! It's hilarious. Dog, just screaming his ass off. Oh, shit. You grab a carrot by the hand. That's, that's, dog. that's the real veggie ah! tales. <laughs> My dreads. <laughs> My dreads. Carrots got dreads. Carrots are black. They got dreads. They got green, gra- green dreads, bro. Green dreads. Fucking carrots are a rapper out of Miami. Hell, with oh, yeah. Green dreads. Orange and green, too? Oh, yeah. You got Bro- some- broccoli got naps. <laughs> 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 broccoli nap. Broccoli got nap here. They use the Murray's and the. Uh, <laughs> broccoli got black. naps. Broccoli is black. Broccoli and carrots, though. They I, out here killing it. One last thing yeah, to yeah. finish up my dumbass yeah, weekend. Yeah. So, Wild of Fury. Yeah. I'm sure we have yeah, seen Fury. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, so. I saw b- pieces of it, but I seen the the last, like the knockout and stuff. Like okay, that. so I'm at the crib. You know, I, I'm at the crib. Me and Chaz, you know, Chaz likes watching boxing yeah. a lot. So. I hit him, I, you know, I knock on his I was like, yo, come watch the, the match. I got it up. I found an illegal way to stream it. I don't know if I said it. I probably yeah. Get arrested. Well, you already said it. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so uh, you know, f- yeah. fuck it. This is my last day on the podcast. <laughs> but, um, but uh, so, yeah, I invite him out we, from my computer. I put, I put it on the screen. You invite him out? 
To the living right room? Right to the living room, yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> Jazz in his Jazz. house. <laughs> We're in the same house. I invited him out to hey, the living did room. You, did you also provide him with a potato? <laughs> <laughs> For yeah, starts one? today. <laughs> okay, okay. It starts okay. today. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so we're watching a fight. Enjoying it. And by the end of it, you know, we, the, you know, we're watching it. And it said it was a draw. And we're like, yeah. what the fuck? Again? This yeah, happened yeah, yeah. again? And so next day, you know, I wake up in the morning. I turn around. I'm like, our dumbasses watched the first fight again. It was a repeat of the first Yo. fight. <laughs> that is like, hilarious. Looking, like, I wake up in the morning. I turn on ESPN. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, let me see what the people are talking about. I'm watching. I'm like, Yo, I didn't on, see this I, fight. I, see, I Yo, missed that the first two ended so much better than I, 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 missed, <laughs> I, I missed the yeah. first two rounds. I'm like, maybe they show highlights from the first two rounds. I'm like, okay, I don't remember this. And then it said uh, 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 Tyson Fury wins. I'm like, hold on. I thought it was... You know, I, and then I stopped. And I was like, "We watched the same fight that's again." That's some old shit. I, that's old as fuck. I, I'm, talking about, about, me I him, you know. I'm talking about me and him are going back and forth. Yeah, man, he ain't do this last time. <laughs> the, like, it's the same exact fight. That we watched is the, so, so funny. obviously y'all don't watch boxing because yeah, y'all didn't no, even know it was no, the same fight. I watched so the first funny. fight and I remember there was when nothing they tied. that reminded you that it, this wasn't. Bro, I said to him, "How like, would you know though?" In the last quarter, in the last what is it called? Round. Round. I don't watch boxing. Yeah. In the last round. I told him I was like, if this ends in a tie again, I'm gonna be mad. But they and don't have a tie. I'm like, again. And he was like, nobody I know, said right? a date on it. Nobody said anything. That's what I'm saying. Ain't nothing current going on in the background. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. <laughs> like, hey, no, there wasn't no recent couples. <laughs> no. The John Singleton <laughs> wasn't in the crowd. No <laughs> right. John Singleton wasn't in the crowd. Ain't no funny. new shit at the MGM. I didn't <laughs> see <laughs> shit. I'm no banners. No topical. Am I wrong? The first one took place in the UK, right? I, I'm I that, that part I'm not it. sure. Yeah, I, I didn't know. watch the but, first one. But yeah, I, I was story. just dying. I was watching ESPN. And I'm like, and then Chaz, I saw Chaz this morning, and he talking about, hey, hey, I think we watched because I didn't talk to him that since. Is, yeah, yeah. He said, I think we watched the the that wrong fight. So I was like, I know we some <laughs> dumbass <laughs> niggas. Like, what the fuck? Oh, None shit. of us knew. Like, come on. Yeah, man. no, but That's yeah, I see, story. I seen the highlights, and it was a knock. It was a knockout from was, from uh from Fury, Fury, and and also. I kept seeing a, a picture of him licking blood mm -hmm. going around. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. needless to say, when his girl's savage. on her period, doesn't matter to him. Oh, man. Yeah, doesn't. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. No, I never thought about that. No, it doesn't matter. He doesn't, doesn't care. Matter. He can't so. be. No, he, no, he running red savage lights mode? all day. I mean, he's a gypsy. Yeah. Uh, well, he literally is, is a gypsy. So, I'm, I think he's down for, yeah. for whatever. What makes it so worse? You didn't know that? He calls no. himself the Gypsy King. He has a big ass But he's that like Snatch. He has a traveling home. He's like Snatch. Guy yeah, movie. he lives like that. Brad Pitt and Snatch. Also, he doesn't like live anywhere. No, he just travels around Europe in boxes. Or, or what makes it so bad? His body is so bad. His body compared bad. To, he to shaped like Dante. potatoes, Emmanuel. He, <laughs> he, 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 he <laughs> shaped like potatoes. <laughs> huh? And he just stay winning. He do stay winning. Like honestly, he looks out of shape. He looks, like, but I know he's not. I know he's not. But he that's not, but what it, makes him so likable. Yeah, that, that, that's what normal. makes him endearing. It's yeah. like, yo, this dude is just a normal. Looks like he Mr. drinks Potato beers Head. at the crib most of the day yeah. and goes to work, and now he's whooping this like, guy's he, ass. He's not like he doesn't have gypsy heritage, does he? Does he just move like a gypsy? I'm not sure, but he, he represents that gypsy life hard. I don't know if his heritage is based on that, but he does. He might have been licking the blood for magic or something. That's, oh God. That's hilarious. You know, gypsy is a derogatory term. Did you guys know that? Is it? No. Isn't that crazy? A, I don't know what's a so bad what, or what good. Do what do you say? Um, because Move they around were, it, I think they were like relocated <laughs> from sovereign citizens. Uh, Egypt. <laughs> Squatters. <laughs> they, yeah. And so they were just like, ah, those gypsies. And they couldn't get jobs. Ah, that's why they got like, that's oh, why they were like fortune wow. tellers. I stuff. never knew that. And, and gypsies. Palmies. Egyptians. Damn, okay. I better stop saying that then. Fuck. That's, that's messed up. <laughs> that's I didn't weird know. for him to be like, yeah, I'm a gypsy. <laughs> I bet you, I bet you no one, I bet you. Well, it's usually not offensive when you are it. Well, it's like, their N word? It might be. No. I on, guarantee you, <laughs> Egyptians don't even. Know what that word is? <laughs> they, they don't, don't know give him. A fuck. <laughs> they don't know him. They don't know like that culture. Like we Egyptian. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, that's, that's, that's wild. But yeah, no, nah, he he won. This, so he that was a title fight. Or yeah, he lost the title. title. Yeah. Yeah. And oh I, shit. Uh, okay. Uh, if you're, uh, what's um, his name? 
Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. yeah. You know what's funny? Like when Floyd Mayweather or like somebody small fights, it's like you really like see the form and you're like, oh, that was like a good right, punch. Right. Yeah. But with, it, with them, I was just like, these are two big niggas yeah. fighting. They're, yeah. fighting. Yeah. They're, They're just literally fighting. sloshing around. Sloshing. Uh, sloshing. Yeah. Yeah. sloshing. <laughs> 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 like when they when they fight, you back up. Yeah. You, like, you ain't breaking that up. You just gotta yeah. move. That's right. like one time we heard with I think uh, Walker was in an interview. He was talking about or Gucci was in. They was like, yeah. He was like, Walker was like, yeah. Me and Gucci got to fight in the studio. What studio was y'all in? That was that. Wow! Time, no way, y'all tore I'm up everything in the studio. Up. I got to move. Just like, <laughs> Jesus Christ, like you can't break that up till they get tired. Yeah, these are two huge men. <laughs> I know they got tired quick. I know they got tired quick. Oh yeah, they got tired seconds. quick. Yeah, big big niggas fighting for yeah maximum fifteen to thirty seconds strong. Well, and, right. Well, and it depends on it. what type of drugs they were on at the time well, that's too. Because they could have uh, been turned up or Jesus. turned down. That's very true. <laughs> and <laughs> rappers that like good rappers are doing like pills and shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Imagine a geeked up walk of just like tearing yeah. the room like, right. oh, walk on. Well, you know he torturing <laughs> vegetables now because he's vegan, so <laughs> he's like killing it. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. No, nah, <laughs> you got to just get in the booth. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah. Just get in the booth. <laughs> Somebody record me. <laughs> Let's just get the booth. That's it. But overall, the fight, the fight was cool. Yeah, you know, I, I, the I, I, cool. I just like, I, I like Fury, man. I'm not going to front. Yeah. I know that's against uh, black people, I guess. No, <laughs> it's a good fight. I mean, you know, people want to be black and white. He's black and white. He's right. <laughs> right? Yeah. He, 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 he really I think he need more training, Wilder. He still fight wild to me. Yeah, he does. It's entertaining. And then he runs out of, like, he runs out of steam quick. Like I mean, yeah. fairly quick. Yeah, you know. But but I was excited to know that that was the uh, to this day guy. Like I didn't, I wasn't in. Oh, oh that was that he's the white day. Yeah. To this day. To this day. To this day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sure. He's a meme. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what? Once, <laughs> once you become a meme, oh, that's yeah. it, baby. What you mean? That's it. You know what? Speaking of meme memes, uh, Pat just found out that the guy falling was Chaz. That meme. You know, from Hugger. I thought you just said when you was writing under it. I thought you said. I didn't know that was you. Or my, maybe that's Tony Baker. No, no, Tony no, no, Baker. no, no, no. I okay. knew that. That Come might be Tony Baker. Okay, because somebody was like, I didn't know that was you, uh, yeah, Chaz. You guys, are like deeply, <laughs> you guys are like deeply intertwined in like like black internet culture. I, I hope know. everyone knows. Yeah. It's it's pretty dope. But not enough that, I, I mean, not. I don't see it enough. Well, you don't be on the internet. Exactly. All right, so, so that's, that's why. Right. <laughs> 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 I don't know you what's know. going on in museums. When's the last time you been to a museum? Uh, right, ten I, years. I, I never been. To <laughs> yeah, that's fully why. caught up in potato culture. <laughs> oh yeah, potato culture. You got once you get into these p- the potatoes, man. You don't know what. What the was the most viral meme though? It was it you disappearing. Or was it Chaz falling? Like it, it might be, have, it, it might be up Chaz. there with Chaz. Is up there with Chaz? Is he the Chaz fall? Is Chaz falling Mike and disappearing? Spin. Yeah, Mike spinning gift that he had. You guys run all running away. Yeah, that was running yeah the black away. people laughing. But people wouldn't know that's us. There's so many yeah, people. Yeah, so in many there. people in there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, they would think that was a gang initiation because a lot of black people <laughs> 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 gathered in one area. That's yeah. nuts how many you It's funny have. you say that because I was watching, Wes made me watch They Gotta Have Us, the Netflix documentary mm-hmm. about the history of black cinema. Mm-hmm. Phenomenal. Watch okay. it. I was like, in 20, 30 years, they're going to be doing the internet version yeah. of this stuff. That's yeah. And all of us going to be getting called yeah. <laughs> in 20, 30 yeah. years. And it was like, damn. And I'm talking about don't be calling me up and ain't sending no check. <laughs> <laughs> With this interview, that's gonna be very interesting. Yeah, yeah. interesting. Because yeah. like the Jordan meme is a part of Black culture. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. solidified. It's just like there's things on the internet that you can't separate. I mean, we yeah. want to because it's so new and it's just like oh, it's, it's, it's the internet. But Jordan like, was so angry during that time in his life. I know <laughs> he just didn't fuck with that at all. I don't feel. I feel I like Jordan is cared. just generally an angry person. That's, yeah, like ain't no happy person going to that. That aisle in Ross and buying them jeans. It, no, <laughs> no, no. If because if he was happy, and he'd have more them, friends. Yes. To tell him jeans. niggas ain't wearing. Jordan Echo. jeans are trash. His yellow eyes. And yeah, his yellow, he has yellow eyes. Ghoulish it's eyes. The most ironic thing about our to fashion me, culture. To me, <laughs> to me, yeah, he has the greatest <laughs> sneaker His probably of all, all time. time. But he didn't design it. He didn't design it. But still, he was there to say, "Yeah, I like that." At least. He that hasn't talked be. about enough. He hasn't that, designed it. That I've heard that a couple of times. I mean, that's watch, still, watch the why show don't you wear um, your own Netflix sneakers out? Abstract. The creator tells I the whole that. story. He I saw My granddad. My granddad. My thing is, he beans. has to pick one: either the loop or the boot cuts. You can't do both. <laughs> the you can't. You can't do loop and boot. No, you can't do loop and boot. <laughs> you can't. Do loop and boot. <laughs> you, can't. Loop and boot. <laughs> you can't. You gotta pick one. I just think, man, he just he just listen. When you're that great, you can't be good at anything else. That's very true. You just can't be good at fashion. You just you are so great as a bat. You don't. That might That's be true. an NBA fact, though. Well, I mean, yeah, come on, honestly. man. Like, they, yeah. just, 
they just don't know. Like you it's can't like be Tom Brady. I I seen his um seventy three questions. Yeah. No personality. Just, just that's why a he's robot. great. He's a, he's a robot. He's a robot. Yeah, he's almost yeah. scary, like serial killer. Like yeah. I'm like, hmm. that's why he's. I great. can see he him be. I can see him be. He could. He could be on what the, the cat uh, documentary. What oh, you say? Watch. Oh, don't kill the cat. Don't kill the cat. That was good. Yeah, that was good. I started. That, that was, was crazy. That was really good. People got free time. Right. Right. You found out where this nigga was from the street last year. <laughs> Internet boy, you can't yeah, post. You can't post. You can't, can't, post. Yeah. you can't post another. Yeah, that's why not in survive out here. That's a gr- that was a great one. Um, that. Harvey so, Weinstein. Hope and, I didn't hear. Uh, you told us that he, he got convicted. Got yeah, convicted. yeah. It's uh, let me see. That's a and it's funny. I didn't hear about it. Oh yeah, yeah. Definitely didn't hear about it. I think it, it. just it literally why. just happened this morning. Oh, okay. oh yeah, okay. this is okay. very That's very why. new. I think right? he got. I'm two not counts. on the internet in the morning. He got two, two. counts out of five. Uh, uh, the uh, the uh, oh, people that are the gotcha. women that parked. Don't tell me it's the lesser. Nah, this kid. I think it's up to 25 years. It could be. This oh. nigga's a hundred years old. Yeah, yeah. How, how long did Cosby? He got away. Yeah. He got. How long did Cosby get again? I don't know. I mean, it's going to be for the rest of his yeah, life. He's, <laughs> yeah. like, he's look. in there blind. He don't know what's going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, when I they mean. said he got hit with a hot dog bun. Yo, I'm, that dog was so bun. I'm not going to lie. I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> what? Yeah, he got, they, <laughs> like, his first week in jail, they bun. said he got hit with a stale hot dog bun. <laughs> and, and I ain't going to lie. I laughed. That was a funny headline. <laughs> Because if you it's blind, like if you blind, you get hit. Oh you don't know what God, it is. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, if you blind, you get hit with a stale hot dog bun. You, you might think a dick just flew at you or something. You don't know what's going on. Just, you know what happened right before the nigga threw that? Some nigga in prison was like. <laughs> watch this. Hey, watch hey, this. Watch this. <laughs> hey, that's Cosby. Watch this. Watch I'm going to throw this stale ass hot dog. You know they laugh. They oh, yeah. ass oh, off after been. that. Don't let it have no condiments party. on this. Ketchup splattered and shit. But how big was it? He, <laughs> got, he got hit with a hot cliff. <laughs> A hot clip. <laughs> a hot clip. <laughs> they don't cry. <laughs> Cause you know uh, you can't. Th- why you gonna throw a stale hot dog bun at a blind nigga? Man? <laughs> that is. He can't see. I ain't gonna lie. I would have been in the back. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't that one distance laugh. <laughs> you just scared. You, you know you ain't got nothing. <laughs> you know you ever you ever been in the lunch room and you yeah. see something about to go down? <laughs> you just in the distance <laughs> and looking at it. You just. <laughs> <laughs> You knew you, no, you ain't got nothing to do with it, but you still laugh. How oh, evil do you have to be to just throw a stale <laughs> bun at somebody? Oh, hey, my God. God. <laughs> oh my God. God, it's that's what we do in the sexual assault people now. We just throw buns at this what, what, what happened? All right, so it says Harvey <laughs> Weinstein trial verdict, guilty on two charges, acquitted on others in New York sexual assault case. New York, uh, Harvey Weinstein was found guilty of sexual assault in New York. It's just do we have to still uh, stay in trial in other cities? Like his L.A. crimes, his foreign crimes? Yeah, uh, I know he, somewhere in like. You know what? I'm not even sure. I, I don't know if. Uh, did people in LA come at him? Like, were there yeah. women? In- oh, yeah. He, he did Absolutely. a lot of it in the Berlin I'm saying that Hotel. actually uh, pursued yeah. a court case? Well, oh, that, that I part. I didn't know so uh, many came out stories about the Beverly Hills Hotel. Was that hotel is Dang, prevalent. He had a spot that he oh, yeah. frequented. Oh, yeah. He went, went back to the same like, spot. Like rape? Yeah. For rape? Yeah. yeah. Was just like, rape. It's just a hotel known for rape. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. That, that was the hotel. That was just his room. room. <laughs> he would get a room there. And that's okay. where he would, you know, do his shit. Okay. Okay. That was his no, no, cave. No. His, yeah. 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 his headquarters. <laughs> Lair. They're not weirdo. known for that. Yeah. Yeah. I was say, what? He's that's known it. for that and doing it in their stuff. You think he going to get hit with? No. Probably potato. Potato ass. He's a potato ass. He's a potato ass. They need something hard. Yeah. just <laughs> but I feel like he, he, gonna do- he, gonna, <laughs> he gonna dodge it like Bush. Like he goes <laughs> Bush uh, dodge the shoe. Oh, like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Bush reflex was crazy with that shoe. <laughs> but uh, yeah, okay. when he get to jail, it's gonna be rough for him. What made it funny when he ducked down and came back up looking <laughs> <laughs> like a like a meerkat? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> you think they gonna have him in general population? Ooh, like in, Harvey? Yeah. I hope so. Yeah, I mean, you think so? He just hey, looked he, like uh, he well, need to I, get socked in the face. Yeah, a few times. I, I did hear they he you know when all these niggas get caught they always say oh he's dealing with health problems now. Uh, yeah, and I did he, hear they saying that about him now. He's dealing with health problems. What does wanna, that do for us though? It doesn't try do to nothing. make you sympathize. Yeah, try to make you sympathize. No, no, no. I think, I think it's, it's for the, the like we can't keep him in general population. He oh, won't be able oh. to stay in prison as long. We might, it might be better to let Same. him off earlier. It's all that type. R. of R. Kelly shit. did it the worst. You know they said he had a toe infection. A toe infection. I mean, Bill Cosby said, "I'm going blind." <laughs> oh, no, he was like, "That's going to change you." A blind toe infection. I'm saying like that's going to change your your sentence. A toe infection. That's what everybody's in bad health in there. Yeah, nigga, get admitted to prison, man. This nigga's in the best. 
<laughs> no, what is niggas doing great? Uh, what is the HIV in prisons like? Oh, in prison? it's, it's, it's 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 a wild. high rate. It's wild. It's probably like on the floor and shit. <laughs> oh my! You oh, can probably man. like slip on it. Like, oh, HIV, hey, Watch out for that HIV right there. That's, that's like so when ASAP Rocky slow. told a story. You fighting in jail and slipping on semen. That's yeah. why in the showers. Is, but how did he know so quick? Like. You know. You're in the middle of a fight. You're in jail. You oh, know. Oh, shit, semen. <laughs> like, well, why they, they were in the bathrooms. They were in the shower. They were in the shower. That's, just, that's yeah. just where people and were that's just letting meat, off on meat, the meat floor. Meat area. Just let, they just yeah, walk yeah. in with their dick out. And yeah. Just yeah. on the floor. It's right. so barbaric. Yeah. I've yeah. never yeah. just met yeah. on the on floor. The floor. <laughs> Clean it up a little bit. I would have to if I'm in prison. Yeah, you got to. I don't want to do it in my cell with my bunk mate there. So I just shoot off in the shower. It doesn't seem like you have like access to Kleenex. And like, I've know, never seen Kleenex. You have, no <laughs> you have no responsibilities in cleaning outside of your cell. So. That's, very true. That's a big responsibility. Just go in there with slippers. <laughs> That'd be funny if prisoners start complaining about Harvey Weinstein. He's jerking off <laughs> in the <laughs> shower. <laughs> this this thing is disgusting. He's disgusting. They're going to take care of it. Oh, yeah. They're going to take care of it. You try throwing potatoes at him, but you just keep fucking doing the same shit. He's the whole Rorschach thing. He's like, you guys are stuck in here with me. You guys are stuck in here. With oh me. my God! <laughs> oh, 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 oh man! <laughs> Throws a bunch of tater tots <laughs> at the fucking face of me. <laughs> you guys are locked in here with oh, me. Jesus Christ! Oh man! Yeah. Oh man! Well, we got right. next. How did we make that? Uh, yeah, that was one. That, I ain't gonna lie. That was one of the hardest stuff. prison lines ever. Oh, yeah, that's a great prison line. <laughs> yeah. I'm not locked in here with you. You're Imagine hearing that and being a prisoner. You're oh like, no, you're scared. Well, damn! Like, I'm like, chilling like, on this side of my bunk mate. Oh, that's not my bunk mate. Yeah, like, or like you're in prison and you're bunk mate. It is fucking the size of the rock or somebody like what am I doing with this? Yeah, like, you in there, he walking. It's, like, it's like fuck, man. Well, I gotta kill him. <laughs> well, you like potatoes, now I gotta man? kill him. <laughs> gotta, now I gotta, I gotta kill, no, kill him. I was only in here for two weeks. <laughs> right? <laughs> Thirty-five like, years now. It's gonna be a long now. Be a hey, let long. me ask you that: If yeah. you only got two weeks, yeah. and a dude the size of rock said you washing my drawers, do you just bite the bullet and say I'm gonna watch? Yeah, I only I'm, got two okay, weeks. I'm, I'm, like, I'm like, what type of detergent you need, brother? Because if you got yeah. years, if you got yeah. if you got years, you gotta fight. But if you only but, got two weeks, yeah, what let type, me not catch a new yeah, case. Yeah, what type of detergent you need? Years? You like it starts to press. I just, I just, oh, you were asking if it starts, you, you need to start to press. press. I would tell him, it's already been done. It's, it's, <laughs> what, what, what if up. he start having, what if it's he already got, been done? What if on all his jaws, he got a streak? He got a shitty streak. I'm just going to uh, well, learn how to get a streak. Well, I'm going to shitty streak in jail anyway, so it don't matter. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to learn how to get a streak. I'm in there washing. Oh, right. I only got two weeks, I just got to bite you the You in there I'm gonna find out how to get some new underwear. Time. Like maybe there's some type of deal, pack of cigarettes, right. and some underwear, right. and I could just give him some new it's underwear. Not washing and shit. It's not. Yeah, it's not. You just gotta wash them yeah. drawers. He too big. Just wash He's it. too big. He's an alien. He's, a, he's an alien. We said on this. Yeah, podcast I'm gonna just ask y'all. Hey, put some money okay. on my books. I'm just gonna buy him new underwear. Yeah. Just throw them away. I got you every day. Yeah, yeah. New underwear. You have a full washer dryer there. Like, yeah. how'd you get it? <laughs> no, I got you, bro. It's actually just coming out. And y'all need anything else? Because I get tired of getting beat up. You're gonna get tired of getting beat up. So it's like really quick. Yeah. How are your money spending habits? All right. Are you doing it the right way or are you doing it the wrong way? Well, hopefully you can tap in and start doing it the right way with our sponsor today, which is Chime. OK, good money habits start with your very first paycheck. And if you just scored your first job, you've got an opportunity to, to jumpstart a healthy financial journey. Look, I wish I had Chime when I was younger because I would have tapped in. But now I have it. And now I'm tapping in the right way. Way When you sign up for Chime and link a qualifying direct deposit, you get access to benefits like getting paid up to two days early and fee free overdraft up to two hundred dollars. You can't beat that, people. OK. And with Chime, there is no monthly fees, no minimum balance and no deposit required to become a member. So what are you doing? Tap in with Chime A.S.A.P. All right, so sign up for Chime checking account today to link your paycheck. It only takes two minutes and doesn't affect your credit score. Get started at Chime.com slash trap. That's Chime.com slash trap. Okay, Chime is a financial technology company, not a bank. Banking services and debit card provided by the Bank Corp Bank N.A. or Stride Bank N.A. members FDIC. Early access to direct deposit funds depend on payer spot me eligibility requirements and overdraft limits apply see chime.com slash spot me
You're not like going to really work quick. Hit. As soon as it happened, as soon as yeah. he hit you, I'm you know done what? With I'm this. done with this. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't here you. forever? <laughs> Y'all ain't here throwing hot dogs, buns, and beating me up. I'm done with you. Y'all ain't here forever? Yo, yeah. Damn. No, that's a long, like, long, long time. The Bill thing was funny, though. Yeah, yeah no, it was funny. <laughs> hey, I, I heard it, there's a possibility of getting knocked out in prison and then waking up to see somebody like sucking your dick. Oh, no, man. No, waking no, up to see that. No, no, no. Like, why would they wake up to give me pleasure? I yeah. don't know. Yeah. I think it's a power game. move. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's almost like CPR. No, uh, it's CPR. No, 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 no. It's just wake you up. See, I'm fighting then. I'm fighting then. You got to fight. Yeah, yeah. You got to fight Do you think you, as soon as you wake up? Like, you swinging. Are you going to start swinging? But, like, you know you kind of wake up a little drowsy. No. So you're going to wake up and be like. You're not going to wake up drowsy. You're going to wake up. But as soon as you see, you're going yeah. to react. You don't move. Yeah. You don't react. No, you, but you, you might be tired. No, no, because you know you're no. in jail. And if you feel any type of pleasure on your day while you're in jail, that's not a woman. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's but not you a might woman. not even remember you in jail right now. Oh, no, no, no. You just got to every out. day you might I'm be in like, jail. Where the fuck am I? Hold on. My dick gonna suck. Oh, maybe that's good. Story. Maybe I'm back at home. Yeah, oh, I, shit, I hold can't on. say who the person was, but they was, in, they was in juvie. He said he woke up. He was telling me these stories. He woke up to a dude jacking off over his face. Oh. And he said he woke, grab, started this, got the dick, the, got to. yeah. Oh. He was in his face like soon as you wake up, so it's like you know you got a I reaction. You. you grab it, and he just start Man, beating the dude up. So you see one dick in one hand, <laughs> and so and then, bitch ass nigga. He was saying what it was. Move. He said what it was. It was a it was a bully dude in there that ran the cells, yeah. and since he was new in there. Like they were testing him, so he would send people to go in there and fuck with oh, him. So shit. one day he said he sent another dude in there like to fight him, and he beat that dude up. He said he had to earn his respect, That's and then they lie. left him alone. This is, and this is juvie. But he said his cellmate was the one that wasn't sent by dude. That That's was a, just a perverted. That's sick an adolescent dude. dick. That's but, crazy. Man. You knew you got to like damn. I'm new. I already got a dick in my face. I beat a nigga up. <laughs> Let me out. I don't know the time span of all of it. Yeah, I know but, the fight happened early, yeah, but yeah, the yeah. old. If that's all some that scary happens in the course of a day, you should be like acquitted of whatever you. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what I mean. These are like yeah. jail Olympics. I heard right. I saw a documentary <laughs> where a new nigga Olympics. had to line it up with eleven niggas back to back. Think about Fighting. that. Think yes. Oh, think shit. about where, that. where, where? Um, I don't know. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, I'm saying, I so, know. so basically, what, what, what he had to go through eleven dudes the first like, day. Yes, full energy niggas. Wait. <laughs> The, the, the tenth nigga's stretching and shit. Like, already fought five niggas. Let me ask you this. I've been on the all meat diet for three weeks ready for this <laughs> shit. Got, what? Two okay. choices. You got two You're choices. going to jail. Okay, going to jail. San Quentin or Rikers? Which one you picking? Oh, shit. I don't, know I don't even know the either. difference. Like what? Like oh, it's just, I know, well, it just uh, all the sounds gang bad. No, the gang activity is much higher in San Quentin. Yeah. And it's definitely a bigger. I might um, go Rikers. Um, Mexican population. So mm. blacks are. They don't really like not blacks. The, yeah, I, I might go Rikers. But Rikers it's, conditions? I know, I know, I know. I mean, who are, are we kidding? Terrible. I'm getting, I'm getting the business in both. It's, right? It don't I'm matter. Getting, oh, this I'm one has fifty percent more Mexicans. So yeah. Yeah. It doesn't matter. It's probably it's almost, you almost got to join a gang in, in L.A. one for protection you could, versus you, you could. Rikers. You could. Where's Rikers? New York. New York. Oh no. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm a, yeah, I think yeah. I'm gonna go to the same Oh quick. no! Just get stomped out by some Tims. Are they? Do they jails have Tims? I don't know. If jails got Tims. <laughs> I think they do. I think Tim's. they do. I feel like yeah, jails I have know. Crocs now. Crocs? That would yeah. be smart. Yeah, they do. Crocs, Crocs did like yeah. a collab with Prison. You know, some dumbass, Crocs Crocs a smart ass prisoner prison. figure out a, how smart. to make a knife that out of them. I just didn't know that. It's not Crocs. They just look like Crocs. They look more like like Yeezy designed. Have you seen them? Like they're like new prison shoes. Yeah, that's his next wave. Like I'm getting into prison fashion lines. What you call uh, Romello shoes yesterday? Oh, because we said he had on this funeral athletic wear in the gym. When he said he, <laughs> Marvin said he had on the Paul Bear nines. <laughs> Paul Bear nines. <laughs> funeral, <laughs> funeral athletic wear. Yeah, funeral wow. <laughs> he, he, like he ready to carry a cast. <laughs> uh, Grave digger sevens. Grave uh, digger sevens. <laughs> um, all right, let me take a quick break, real quick. Uh, we'll be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, so, uh, it's a uh, it's some fraud going on on the internet. I hear some uh, Listen, some scamming. Everybody right now is scared of getting scammed, right? Yeah. In the internet world, especially in like, Atlanta. Yeah, I mean, even you know, there's been stories of like people. Like I heard this one story of this this lady who supposedly was about to get robbed, and then a homeless man gave her the last twenty her his last twenty dollars that he had. Yeah. For her to get away, like go get Last. get away. She needed gas or something weird okay. like that. She was like stuck and she needed to go get gas. So yeah. he gave her the last one. 
and got away. It became a big news story, mm -hmm. and she, they opened up a, a, a GoFundMe mm -hmm. for the homeless man to, to try to pay yeah. it back, and it raised over four hundred thousand dollars. Oh shit! Come to find out, this was all scammed yeah, from not. three different people. They like, was all, they was the all involved. The girl, the homeless guy, and oh, it was the a boyfriend. Robber. At that point, yeah, you're the just robber. A, you're the a good writer. Yeah, you're, <laughs> you're an amazing writer. You should <laughs> be in Hollywood. Yeah, uh, it's not but, bad. No, but like they 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 scammed and they, they got four hundred thousand dollars off of that it. Sucks. That's that would have been a great oh. story too. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like so. There's there's a lot of these stories online about yeah, yeah. that. You know, like different ways people are getting scammed, whatever. And so I feel like people are really quick to come up with conspiracy things. Yeah. Today. And in the case of uh, Quaid and ba Bales, Bales uh, <clears throat> this was a nine-year-old kid. Yeah. I believe he's in, I'm not sure where he is, to yeah. be honest with you, but he's a nine-year-old kid. He w There was video. Was it Australia? What's something like that? I don't know. UK, Australia. UK I'm, I'm one Australia of those, I think. Man. But he's a, a he's a nine-year-old kid, and he has dwarfism, mm -hmm. um, and he got bullied at school. Yeah. The video went viral. Him Basically, crying. his mom taking video of him crying and saying, I want to kill myself already mm -hmm. at nine. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? And all this shit. <clears throat> and she was just trying to raise awareness for it or whatever. Um, I'm, I think within a, a couple hours, they were talking about, oh, this kid is actually an 18-year-old scam artist. The <laughs> and that they've been raising money for him. And they started finding these pictures where there, he's at he's a birthday Gucci. party. He in the club. <laughs> in the club. He in the club. In the corner post. <laughs> but they start finding pictures of him at, at an 18-year-old uh, uh, yeah, birthday yeah, party. Yeah, yeah. There's many different people in the picture, but yeah, for yeah. some reason they said it was his birthday. <laughs> Uh, and and it, was little, giant, it was like a giant 18. Like, yeah, who, has, yeah, who does that? <laughs> <laughs> but, it's like uh, over evidence. Right. So, mm -hmm. you know, they try. Turns out he's just a kid. You know, they they, mm -hmm. they invited him to to do many things. Like a couple, like Wolverine shot in the mouth. So he is a kid. So he is a kid. He is a kid. Okay, for that's sure good. is a that's kid. Good. But that's people good. were running with it. People like, were running this with was the a story. Okay, gotcha. You know what I'm saying? And, gotcha. Um, you know, so now that they're trying to bring awareness to it. Yeah. Well, they started a GoFundMe to send them to Disneyland. They asked for 10000 They got over 400000 Shit. GoFundMe. Be I didn't know so that. So it's not a I scam. Come up. <laughs> no, it's not a scam. You sure? According to all details right now, I heard it's not it a scam. He, he, he went on, uh, he did, he, he's been traveling around now. Like, he, he did a rugby. He, he's on a press tour He came now. out with a rugby team recently. He came like out. He, oh, I thought you said, like, he started a rugby team. Right. I was like, oh, shit. No, no, but no, no, no. He came about his bread. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> no, but he came out with, like, you know, they, yeah. they ran out yeah. on the field with him okay. and, and different things. He goes to school. It's all legit, but it's just funny how... We're so quick to jump to conspiracy I feel on like some now of these things it's... because it, it. And I'm not even faulting people that would say, "Why would you think like that?" Because the mean, last one, happened. remember the last one, the That's big one, yeah. For everybody, cry, yeah, and he that was a scam. Yeah. Which one? I can't remember. It was, it was a Colton, kid who wasn't in Colton. Yeah, remember the kid we yeah. talked about in the podcast. All yeah. celebrities were um, sending him tweets, and they were sending yeah. him money, and it became a scam. It was a scam. Well, was it a scam, or did they find out his parents were like white supremacists? Something like that. It was, it was something crazy. Something crazy. Yeah, and that's why we're nervous, and that's why we don't trust <laughs> <Yeah>. anybody. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> we're just like little kid with disabilities. <laughs> nah, thirty year old man. <laughs> that's, that's why we. That's why we scared when the kids coming to us asking for money for the football teams outside the grocery store. Right. It's like. <laughs> I, but I told you how to combat that. Tell them to, on the spot, show you their highlights. Yeah, show me your highlight reel. Oh! <laughs> yeah, show me your every reel. kid these days got their highlights on YouTube. Yeah. Show me your highlights. Show me your highlights. If you can't do that, I can't give you money. <laughs> I even hilarious. play. Like, show me your team's highlights. Show me, yeah, show no, me. No, no, even no. that. Show no, even that. Because I don't highlights. even think they'll have that. <laughs> yeah, show no, me. Show I don't, me I don't even highlights. believe their team exists. <laughs> show me your highlights. That's how I feel. Well, That's I play funny. for the the, the Warriors. And yeah, it sounds fake. <laughs> yeah, it sounds fake, man. Like I play for the accountants. So. Like, but you're the accountant. <laughs> show me your highlights. Show, show me your highlights. <laughs> I, wow. we, I play for the CVS. I'm standing outside of the CVS. Speaking of highlights, so we got written up here, Lizzo Thong. First off, Lizzo is a phenomenon because uh, she plays a flute, and that's already just cool. Okay. That, that, Big girl that, playing that, the flute—that's kind of that's kind of fire. That's what I'm breaking down. And she's, and she's really like good. That. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, she a while ago came out at a Lakers game with a thong on, and this thong is this whole image is interesting. But this is not the same one from when she wore the t-shirt with the, the back out yeah. at the Lakers. Yeah, game. That, this, yeah. So it's the same situation. Yeah, no, it's not the same situation, but. So she says she's not. Um, she they ran into Tommy Hill figure right, and he said he will be down to work with Lizzo in some capacity what? for a new line. He works um, with black people. Now? Telling us he <laughs> thought she was a star. It seems like they got in touch, and Lizzo says she's landing on good old fashioned thongs as what they might be working on. 
which makes sense because that's their thing. And I started, so I started thinking. I was like, now will these thongs be just plus size thongs? Mm-hmm. I think she should market. Just to the plus size women with plus size thongs, because you know they have plus size stores that makes sense. and all this stuff. So I'm like, I wonder, or if she, or if she gonna go everybody thong. I said, I don't think she should do that. It should be all plus size thongs. And I just thought about how funny mm. that would look in the store with all these, mm-hmm. <laughs> all these oversized <laughs> thongs Tung up. hanging in the store. Let me ask you something. Yeah. Does like Rihanna, she has a brand, right? The like lingerie, lingerie. Yeah. yeah. Does her underwear only come in like her size? Or does no, she no, have she, she, for big everyone? She has big, big girls, covers, big she girls. Yeah, everybody, wear everybody, stuff. everybody, everybody. Yeah. Okay, everybody. You too. If I, I mean, want, yeah, if he wanted a thong, yeah. <laughs> if I wanted a thong, yeah. But but nah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I, I think. How do you just do it for big? That's girls? what I was like. I was like, I don't know. It's just because <laughs> just they're usually neglected in the market. It's true. Right. It's true. So that so works. why not? This is her brand. It makes sense. It would yeah. make sense. But do you really want? I mean, I, I get this. Do I really her want brand. big girls wearing thongs? Really want? No. Do you really want like? What are you trying to say, <laughs> sir? <laughs> you really want big thongs? <laughs> like, like, uh, is that what we're promoting? Yeah. We, st- we no, really we promote promoting. It ain't about promoting. It's, it's about that's her they brand. They are big. They are. Like, <laughs> why would she make it for for her? <laughs> You she ain't saying? making these. Yeah, I feel yeah. like, I yeah, yeah. She's like not making them big. Yeah. Wearing a thong. You gotta earn. You gotta no. earn. What in the gym? No. Where, you, where, you, where no. you gonna earn no. wearing no. a thong? At? You got with your no. body. No. Like you gotta. No. You gotta. Do you feel the same for um, bathing no. suits? For certain bathing suits on certain people, yeah. Like, like you gotta yeah, earn they, that. Now they should fit you, but suit. that's what I'm saying. Maybe these thongs are gonna be made for that body type, for comfortable bodies. For. We call them like slingshots. <laughs> <laughs> you need, no, if we ever you end up in a kind of fun, that's if, if we should, ever end up in a Walking should. Dead situation, big girls already have a weapon on them. Oh yeah, pull that I, think, I think that she should make it for her. She should. She make it for her, her, her group for the big girls. That's right? for and they have a whole video of them just shaking ass and big thongs. I'm just waiting for her to lose weight because it's gonna come. <laughs> it's gonna come. It's gonna, no, no, gonna I'm come? not saying. I'm waiting for her because she's gonna lose weight yeah. and all her fan base is gonna be uh, like. Oh, I see what you're, you're saying. losing weight. You're betraying us now. Like you're not a part of that the, the, the big sense. girl. Yeah, betrayal. That, that that's gonna happen. Sense. Watch. I'm, like, I'm fucking trying to be healthy. healthy. What are you talking yeah. about? They already said that with uh, the. That what's that British singer? The uh, oh, Adele. Tw- Adele. They yeah. already said that with her. Her fan base. A lot of her fan base came after after she lost weight, saying, "Really? Oh, you're not. You're not represent. I thought that's who you were. Well, that's good. And, like, I like when Adele goes through stuff because her album be fire when she goes through stuff. That's a weird thing to go through though. How do you even process that? Yeah, you don't. I thought you guys liked me. <laughs> yeah, you, I don't know. When, how would you get mad at somebody for losing that's weight? What I'm but saying. that's what I'm saying. She's putting out there, big girl, everything, big yeah, girl, very everything, right? Take it yeah, it becomes yeah. a cultural, that's true. a part of the culture yeah, yeah. of what she's creating, right? It becomes a way. But wave. when it when real re, uh, reality sets yeah. in, that hey, it might not be that healthy to be like this. True. And true. they and knowing Lizzo or some successful people like her yeah. have access to trainers, good, you know, could eat better. Well, I and think that's eventually where it is. might. Well, then she would inspire she, everyone. That's to what I'm eat saying. Healthy. That would be the, the but is that well, counterintuitive? But but by, by, by no, saying that she's saying love yourself where you yeah, are, but she ain't saying you can't improve. Yeah, that's true. And so if she documented saying? it, would probably help a lot of people. Yeah, yeah that's true. right. I gar- I, I agree that's with true. that. So if she, if could she doc- just go the transformation route. Oh, but I do okay. think she I does have a large fan base that wants her to stay big. No pun. You know that's, that's that's and on them. I mean, I didn't go she, she gotta live. She gotta live her life. <laughs> I had to. She gotta live her life. Like, do, <laughs> it's a lot of people that want us to do the, the fucking with Chaz, but yeah, you gonna true. still do it for. The, you gotta live your you life. Gotta live your gotta life. improve. Yeah. So, but I, keep I, going. I'm I'm interested to see if it's really gonna happen though. But I just this picture is actually quite hilarious with this thong out. Can I see it real quick? Yeah, it's the, it's the you know that uh. It's, it's the the back was cut out. It's not like we accidentally yeah, yeah. saw the thong. Like she was right. Like, she's thong. purposely. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just Inside saying, man. Thong. Like if that was a regular, like everybody need representation. If that yeah. was a regular size girl doing that, we yeah. would all look at her like she's being a jackass, right? We'd be like, why are you wearing I mean, that to people, court? I thought people, that was a little much. No, people Isn't thought that, that was a little much too. People thought, thought that was a little much. much. I like Lizzo, but I think that yeah, the yeah. parading part, like is your whole ass is out. Yeah. And it's all in, it's like one. But PC culture is just like, you know, like, well, we don't say anything, you know? Yeah. So yeah. it's just Fuck weird. That shit. <laughs> let's just, just say it and weird. talk about it. And so, <laughs> let's just say it and talk about things. <laughs> let's Since we're about. on women and things going on, uh, Erica oh, Badu's yes. $50 Badu Pussy Premium mm. Incense sells out okay. in less than 20 minutes. I still want to smell it. Yeah. So I, one dude on the internet ate the incense. Hold on. He, I saw that. Yeah, he ate it. The, the candle. 
Is he candle or incense? He ate incense. He mm-hmm. ate. He said, mm, "Oh man, oh, that wasn't like, good." He was doing it for. He was it doing, wasn't good. Yeah, yeah. Like it was, it was like calm down. It it's fucking. It's, it's like an incense, incense at the end of the day. <laughs> like yeah, yeah. It tastes <laughs> right. like incense. What the yeah. scent is. Right. He turned into a whole tab as soon as he ate. <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing is, by the smell of incense, you just knew how that tastes. Without yeah, ever like, it tastes like incense. You just yeah. know that. You know what incense tastes like. I just assume it tastes like ashes or something. Yeah, yeah. That's better. I feel like you only do that if you're doing some type of ritual, like you're sacrificing something. Them. But yeah, it sells out in 20 yeah. minutes. Um, it's impressive. It says uh, yeah, she gave a pussy update and was like, thank you to everybody that uh, bought everything. She's like, well, guys, pussy thank update? you for, for making our debut of Badussi but, uh, sell out uh, in a matter of 19 minutes. Badu told her <laughs> 3.9 wow. million followers on Instagram. The incense was available for pre-sale on Thursday, February 20th at a cost of $50. That's a lot for incense. I ain't never paid that for much for one incense. incense? No, it's probably a pack. It's probably a pack. Um, was created with the ashes of Baidu's underwear, pure resin, handmade, sun-dried, also created with essential oils and herbs. Wait. The so ashes they burned of her, her panties? So they, yeah, they, they made her wear some panties all day, threw it in the stuff that you cremate, niggas. Oh, my God. <laughs> the Cremated ashes panties. fell down, slid it back out, slid it back out <laughs> and put it into an incense form. You know I love Eric from Baidu. That. I still want to smell this incense. That's what's it's super weird. I know, but it's, it's going to smell like essential oils. <laughs> but it's going to smell like look, a candle shop. I don't want to necessarily order this. I just want to be at an incense shop and they got it. Oh, let me smell it. Oh. I want to light one and not tell anybody. Just to, <laughs> just in case somebody walks in and be like, this kind of smells like pussy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kind of got a little Badu in it. Yeah. Just to experiment. It smells a little like. Or bring a girl, bring, like bring, bring a girl over. Um, it, it, it says like, uh, Badu announced that she'll be selling the incense that she has. The fragrance of Regina stated that she recognized the power that's been attached to her for so many years. There's an urban legend that my pussy changes men. She says about the that. rumors, uh, the men that I fall in love with and fall in love with me change jobs and lives. The eclectic artist launched Badu World Market. Items that are available for purchase include bespoke clothing and accessories as well as apothecary goods and traditional music merch and of course what Badu calls her superpower the incense that smell like her vagina I took lots of pairs of my panties cut them up into little pieces and burned them as she describes the method for a new product even the ash is part of it she insists that she finished product Badu's pussy will smell as advertised the people deserve it do we hey man listen I don't have the confidence to do this you well, you're not gonna put you're not gonna burn your ain't underwear. Nobody, nobody want no briefs, buying, no pat briefs. Well, I'm not they, just saying they ain't like pat penis. <laughs> I'm not, I'm pat penis. Saying, <laughs> the, that going pat wrong. Penis, paprika. <laughs> no, no, no. We gotta we gotta they brand that. that. Pat penis paprika. Yeah, pat yeah. penis paprika. My balls. The smell the of my title, balls. Title option. Title option. Title option. <laughs> pat penis paprika. No, that's that's, a, that's a very risky move. Because <laughs> imagine doing that and it don't sell. Oh my god. Got a whole bunch of pussy incense. She knew you just got boxes. Stacked up in your He's apartment. Like, like, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> now I gotta be out here selling pussy on the side. <laughs> uh, that's but she hilarious. knew it was a sale. She knew it was. She knew sale. It was yeah, Everyone it, can't do that. Yeah, Certain people can do can't that. do. Well, you know, Gwyneth Paltrow just did the same thing. Yeah. She did a candle. Though. She, she did, did a candle. candle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And people are comparing them. And I think it's just crazy that both of them were in the lab. Really like making <laughs> pussy products. <laughs> smell my pussy yeah, products. Yeah, smell my pussy. And then they heard about the other one. Like, damn, you doing the pussy thing she, too? I'm, I'm just imagine her in the like. Imagine you walk in the house and your mom cutting up panties in the living room. Mom, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, I'm about Insane. to burn these. <laughs> I'm about yeah, to burn yeah, these. Why do you want? Oh, don't work with this shit in my I'm house. I'm be so mad. <laughs> I'm be so mad. I'm moving out. I'm moving out. So I don't want to ever shit. smell this. Yeah, You're my mother. But yeah. what the funny thing is, what if you just found out? Like when you are fifteen or something, like she oh. every day you you smell you smelling, your house, yeah, yeah. you were smelling it. You're like you were lighting some of them. That's the that's you were lighting some of them. Yeah, you were lighting some of them. I'm gonna be like, traumatized. Yeah, I'll be traumatized. I'll never like incense again. Oh, no, that's, that's hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. Eighteen yeah. years what old, you think you, you smell <laughs> this whole time? This, 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 no, mom, no, no. <laughs> your friends giggle every time they walk in. It's like pussy. Like your mama pussy. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. So that's why they was laughing. Can I get some of that? Wrong mama pussy uh, <laughs> scent. Uh, oh, man, stop it. 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 You come in there kitchen, you just see Those me things. handing a couple dollars to your mom. Like, get some of that candle. No, man, put that candle back. Let me get some of your underwear. Yes. <laughs> I got a girl coming over. Oh, oh my God. Man, what's this Alexa thing? Yo, so, so I'm interested. So, all right. So, Alexa, there's a kitchen playset, but it's also kind of creepy. So, it's a kitchen. It's called the Alexa two in one kitchen set. And it's $299. <laughs> 
Um, it debuted at the Toy Fair, so this pa- they had a Toy Fair <laughs> recently. So basically, when kids uh, they have a collection of accessories, and then like kids walk through, it helps them walk through recipes, make shopping lists, plays guessing games, and provides a healthy dose of puns. So they're teaching them to be a consumer. <laughs> that so <laughs> one side is the kitchen, you flip it; the other side is the grocery store. So the lady on the interview was like, "Oh, so I have my pot. Uh, they might have a picture here. This is a this is a toy. It's a toy. Okay. So it's it's only it well, only kind of nice. It only works if you have an Alexa though. So you buy the two hundred ninety nine set dollar kitchen set and, and Alexa. Nice. Okay. So you put the no more pictures. Yeah, you put the Alexa on there, and so she started. She took a pot and she was like, "Oh, let me put the pot on the thing." And Alexa was like, "Oh, it's heating up." And then she was like, uh, it was like, oh, it's empty. And so she was like, oh, let me flip it around, go to the grocery store. You flip it around, they got a little, they got a little bag, you take the little hot dog, scan it across the thing, and Alexa says, one ninety nine. Da da all this shit. Parents are concerned that this is gonna make kids bossy. Because when they said they're gonna be yelling at this kitchen set and being like, Oh, well, Alexa, fix this now, fix this now. So a lot of parents are concerned with white buy- parents. That's white what parents. we all thought. Yeah, 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 white parents. A lot of parents are concerned that it's gonna make them more bossy. And I was like, Why would it make them more bossy? It's just a it's a kitchen set, but it's also kind of creepy because now it's a lot of information in your house because each each item like the skillet, they all have chips in them. Like each thing has. So they're low key learning. From this, or? No, they probably are learning, but a lot of people are concerned with the privacy because now Alexa is being alone with their kids. <laughs> so they feel oh, have like you heard about, have you heard about the people the... hacking the Alexas and, and speakers and people like pedophiles yeah, talking what, to kids? Oh, like what, what they're doing with the ring. Yeah. So yeah. now it's a little that? different Curry. because now – no, 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 the ring cameras. The ring cameras. People hacked yeah. them, and like people were like, voices were coming through, like, "Hey, little girl, like, do you? I'm Santa oh, Claus. You want to be best that's friends?" That's fucking yeah. weird, it's man. Really and so it's like each of these has a sensor, so they're like, "I don't know if I want this many sensors in my house." Like each thing, like the skillet, the the and bag. What do you think the, can happen with that? They just feel like it's it's more taking information. It's somehow. just taking information. It's more, and it's because these are kids. Because like, if you downstairs and your kid upstairs, and you know, Alexa just like. Hey, what's up, my nigga? What you ever cooking? Right. <laughs> like, you're like, what? You don't know what's going on. So, well, why don't those parents just not buy it? That's what that's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was like, just don't, just don't buy. If you're that that's concerned, that's the shit I just don't get, man. If that you concerned, just don't buy, buy it. the product. You buy, it, you set it up. I don't know if I like this. Yeah. Wait, what? Did you? I read think they're. I think it? they're scared that this will be the future of toys. True, more. That that's what it is. Yeah, they know they're not. All of these, that's obviously, tight. those parents not gonna buy it. They're just scared what the future of toys yeah, are because everything is gonna be voice command and voice thing and this and but that. Still, and the third. I still don't see like the extra like. I don't like. No, I mean, but, I didn't see a problem with, but it's I, just a kitchen. Like all you are doing is just putting fake food. Putting in fake, fake food and, and all I mean, it runs. It, you know you. It tells you what you need to for recipes and stuff like that. I mean, it's honestly you learn how to cook. The funny a, part is a black parent will just put the kid in the kitchen. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> learn, yeah, yeah. learn and make just lunch. Snap these, <laughs> this shit, just go in there. Snap these peas for me. <laughs> <laughs> He's sitting there for twenty hours. <laughs> the, the, the kid gonna get mad and be like, "Alexa, you're not moving fast enough. I, I got a cake in the oven and shit." You, you That's play. a really interesting problem that they thought they were gonna have. <laughs> <laughs> they thought they were. <laughs> Look, it says, it's gonna make my kids boss. On one hand, it's a screen you free. You bought them a $300 kitchen. On That's one hand, them <laughs> <laughs> your husband is not there and, and constantly dictating people. <laughs> on one hand, boss. it's a screen free interactive experience. Kids will enjoy the sets, details, and the two sided setup. Fosters play with friends and siblings. Your child won't be able to control smart home devices. Ask Alexa the weather or do anything else with the voice while the kitchen set is still in use. So they basically saying when it's when it's set up to the kitchen thing, you can't do anything else with it. But it's technology; you can do what you want. To. That's what, you know what it is. You can do you what you want. You know what it all comes down to: <laughs> shitty parents just need an excuse. Yeah, <laughs> they okay. just need an yeah. excuse. They're just like, well, maybe that's why my parents, yeah. my kids are <laughs> shitty. Yeah. Like, yeah. It's like no, you, there's like seven things making your kids bossy, yeah, yeah. and you're one of them because you're letting the Alexa kitchen take care of your child yeah. while you're not there. Yeah. <laughs> All saying this thing, the Kardashians. Blah, 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 blah. This right. is all these reasons why no. my kids are so shitty. It's like no, no, no not at all. <laughs> be Your a kids good parent. were destined to be. But shitty I thought it was interesting. It looked like a cool toy to me. I, I thought it was interesting. Hey, I think I'm gonna call it on this podcast. Alexa's gonna be a real person in like five years. Five. <laughs> mm. Okay. Okay. Five to ten. Like, five to ten. like did you bring it your home? Like, no, like I think somebody's gonna take it too far and make Alexa a walking around. Yeah, person. robot type of person. Yeah. 
I can see yeah, that. I can see that. I can for sure. And you can fuck them. Like, like, like well, those are already out. What's the movie? Like, you can, you can name those what you Alexa, want to. What's the Alexa. Ex Machina? Oh, not Alexa. What was that movie? Oh, Ex, be like ex that? Machinima? Ex Machina? 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 I think it's Ex Machina. Yeah, yeah. That's happening. Yeah, no, it's happening right now. What's happening right now? Bone Thugs collab with Buffalo Wild Wings. No. It was a funny commercial. It was a funny commercial. It was called Boneless Thugs, changing their name to Boneless Thugs and Harmony, and it was hilarious. It was hilarious. Not going to lie. It was Boneless Thugs and Harmony. Great sketch. And cra- was it Crazy Bone that didn't want to change? Bone. Crazy Bone was like, I'm not changing the name. And everybody was like, it's, you got to do it. He said, I ain't changing shit. She was like, listen, it's, it's they, they the wings, it oh, just okay. they don't have the bone in them. And so it's a whole skit thing. That shit was funny. funny. I got to yeah. check this out. Boneless funny. Thugs yeah, in Harmony? Boneless, and then they started boneless. rapping at the end. What was the, what did they flip? Uh, uh, boneless, boneless. No, it's boneless, boneless. Yo, it's boneless, boneless. <laughs> Tell me what you gonna do when you need them bones and fries. <laughs> It's so funny, it's, and it's fun. I was like, "There's so we're not is rapping. there a little bit of racism in there?" Because like, oh, well, uh, you, yeah, there's gonna be some people to connect the dots because it's chicken. like black people. But I don't know if it's racist because like, there's nobody that can market chicken like black. People. We, like, clearly, Popeyes just showed just, us how it was done. They, they got us, clothes. They showed yeah. us the chicken print. Right. Yeah, they got clothes. They got, they got full clothing line. line. <laughs> Boneless thug. I, I'm not gonna lie. That's that hilarious. A great idea. That's, That's a great funny idea. idea. My That's only funny. issue is that, like, I'm seeing a lot of my favorite songs from the past <laughs> just be cornified yeah, yeah. by white people. I was going to say. Take. Like, when they did that, even though you Burger, know, King. Was cute, Burger King did the uh, Return of the Mac and, and Cheeto. I hated that commercial. It was Mac catchy. It was catchy. It was Not going to lie, it was catchy. It was but catchy, I hated it. but it's like, nobody want to listen to that shit no more. <laughs> so, yeah, so when, song. when is a musician allowed to do this? Once they go broke, but I can't they be need mad. More money. We, <laughs> no, 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 that's for sure. That's, that's we what they're doing. We've, we've, done it. Right. we've done it. We flip shit. Yeah, so yeah. I can't be mad when they do it. Yeah. Well, well, I saw another one the other day. Fuck, what was it? There was another song they flipped again. I was like, come on, man. They ruining everything. <laughs> but Bone Thugs, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I, I think. But that skit was, that was funny. I, was Buffalo funny. Wild Wings. I was it like, was that's, funny. that was, was good. Funny. It that was, was funny. Because you, I wouldn't even think about Bone Thugs and Harmony. Do it. it was like, okay, Boneless Thugs and Harmony. That's, that's funny. So what's the price? What's the price where you're like, man, fuck this song? <laughs> <laughs> what's I mean, the price? <laughs> fuck. That was a good one, man. What's the price? I don't know. Because, I mean, some of these companies be throwing bread to the point where if, I'm sure if I saw the check, you'd be like, okay, I, I, I get it. I understand. I it's like, don't make you, your other songs stream more. It, it could. For, white, it, for, for mostly white people that never heard it before, which is good for that artist, I guess. If you are, yeah. if you are but artist that it is not the, relevant anymore, like MC Hammer, what commercial was he in during Super oh, Bowl? Oh, yeah, he was in, I forgot which commercial, but yeah, he did the MC Hammer. Yeah. If you MC like Hammer, why not? I haven't seen MC Hammer since. Since that commercial, you're not. <laughs> but you're I not. Streams I, went up. I hope I see Bone Thugs again. I really like them. Yeah, <laughs> you weren't thinking about Bone Thugs. You haven't like, been thinking about yeah. Bone Thugs. Like those Somebody told man. us to go when listen to Bone, Thugs, to Bone Thugs, Thugs album. They got a new. They got a new album. Listen. Somebody told me to go listen to it. You was not. I'm, I heard it. Was, I'm, I'm gonna go listen to it. Shout out to Bone Thugs. Yeah, shout out to Bone Thugs. I'm gonna go listen to it. Yeah, not for real. I would do something with Bone Thugs. Oh yeah. Speaking of rap. So yeah. So last week was the Brit Awards and. I made y'all watch two performances, one from Dave, one from Storm. Hold on, the what awards? Brit Dave? Awards. Brit, yeah, Brit? It's, a, it's an artist, uh, British. His name is artist. Dave? Yeah, Dave. Dave. Dave the rapper. Dave, Dave, Dave. <laughs> so, people it's are a, going straight to the point now. Sounds have you, seen, have you, you seen Top Dave. Boy, the new season of Top Boy? Uh-uh. You, you don't watch Top Boy? Have you, you yeah, know, I've seen that. He's the one, the villain. Oh, that's him. That's yeah. Dave. Yeah. Oh, sure. He's, okay. a, he's like the Donald Glover of UK okay, to me. Okay, all right, all right. And I listened to his album, Phenomenal. Oh, the album it came out last year. It's okay. called Psychodrama Phenomenal. Gotcha. Stormzy, Stormzy is really good. I like Stormzy. So my question is, yep. do you think British rappers can take over hip hop like they have British people are taking over acting? No. Ooh. No. Now look, you wouldn't have said that probably about British actors like that. But look what the wave that has come. They have no, you taken, always would have said that about they, British they, people. They hide have it really, really well, take though. It, they have taken over. You don't yeah. even know these people are British. No, you that's right, interview though. For sure. Now, I'm not saying it'll be like within the next five yeah, years. Yeah, I'm yeah, saying, saying do you think they could? Because British people are talented. They're they are. talented enough to come and take over hip-hop they are, but no. at some point. Well, they no. never really Why took not? over. Well, one, a lot of people that don't even like the, the, the tone of the voice when rapping. Well, British I rap. think a lot of people haven't really listened to the good ones or listened to it enough. I, like, even though I like Storm and stuff like that, I, I, probably, I can't listen to it a lot. Because it's, it's, it's kind of annoying. Like, I, really, when they rap. Listen like, to Dave's album. I want to listen to it. I give it a chance. But I'm still getting used to it. Like, I just... 
I don't. I don't. It's the accent, bro. It's the, it's, I don't really. I don't think it's they. Not, not, so when it comes to music, I don't think they gonna. That's not. They're not touching that. It's not. It. It, it, it might get close, and it might be. I don't need, yeah, no, not happening. I'm not it. saying they are either, but yeah, I, don't I, see I, I just wanted to pose that's that a, question. That's a good question. Because right, right now, question. the best actors are all brilliant. Oh, but for, sure. me, and you for me, know they for are. Sure. It's, it's, it's like, always been like that, though. And I feel like they not hide necessarily. it. Like, Idris Elba can do an amazing American actor. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So when I saw the switch, I was like, fam, you really <laughs> are good. <laughs> but I think that there are They created British, acting, though. Who, you know what I'm saying? They created yeah, acting. Shakespeare. I mean, that's like- It's art. They created it. They started it. But I think that in terms of music, there are singers who can hide it, and I didn't know that they were like, their singing voices. Yeah, like, they sing voice. Yeah, yeah. But it's just like, I can't- Listen to a nigga talk about selling drugs with a British accent. I just pictured him sticking a bayonet out. I want my peas, fam. I want my peas. I want to drive by with some knives. I'll be honest with you. My favorite two accents is British and New Orleans. And I love the accent outside of the rap. hip hop. Listen to Dave. Rap is aggressive. Listen to it. But even when he, when you show, when I played the video today, that was hard. I get that was hard. You gotta get out. You gotta get out of it. You gotta get out of it. Let no, it go. I don't have to get out of it. Get it's out just, of if you don't like it, it's just it. maybe yeah. not my taste of because the Because when you didn't like it, it was bad rap you heard first, probably. Oh, it oh. wasn't, it, they weren't bad it's rappers. Bad it was rapping. the voice. It's yeah, the, you just don't like it. Was not voice. It's, not, it's not as pleasing to the ear. As hear like, ye, uh, hear ye. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Hey, hear ye. But I'm, I want to go listen to it. When you hear the quality, the best of the best of them, it's like, yeah. Because like Stormzy's good. I've heard a couple, and I'm like, this this is good. I just, Dave, I'm trying I to figure out how I, long I could. I think Dave mm-hmm. is the one, though. Yeah. Somebody's going somebody's to crack through. And I think, yeah, and, I, yeah. and, and I actually, it does make me think about what I said earlier about Atlanta, like nobody taking it from mm-hmm. Atlanta. Maybe the next wave will be British. outside of the country. It could be. It could be like well, like where hip hop lives because be, eventually it's it not. It would have to be London. I would say Africa. It anything. could be. It could be Africa because well, you got worldwide think. like Afro pop. Everyone, yeah. Is. Even if you don't like, but it like, don't have to you be. Afro-pop. Even if you don't know what they're saying. The, the, the rhythm of it, you it, just yeah. don't want to move. But yeah. I'm just saying, like mm-hmm. actual rap, rap. Yeah. I would, UK say, I would say Mexico or or, or Canada. Canada, Mexico. Mexico yep. The uh, Mexicans are coming out rapping okay. now lately. Okay. I haven't heard one. You haven't heard on Drake's music or none of these songs he'd be rapping with Mexicans? I feel like my ears would accept that. But when that I don't even know what you're saying, <laughs> like, I don't know what they're saying, so it's just, it's but hard they, for me to they, listen to that if I don't know what you're saying. That's true. Yeah, I don't that's know how what, I feel about like, British. I can still understand spin. the British or Canadian <laughs> rapper, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or at least with Afro pop, I know the rhythm of it, like. It doesn't matter, though, because the world, like, we've become a way more uh, of a global community, right? So yeah. uh, what America cares about, you know, it's still top dog. We're still top dog yeah, in yeah. terms of like pushing culture across the yeah, world. Yeah. But eventually, you know, it's not gonna matter. The next yeah, big rapper yeah. could be from China. Or what it could if, be. if you actually it's like rap with like substance, substance. I would put Dave's album amongst <laughs> Anybody who came out last year, okay. American wise, so it's like substance, substance wise. Yeah, okay, for sure, for sure. I, okay, I, I listened to like him. actually saying something. Like, I, I listened to it. It was no fillers because even when it was, he was only one song I didn't like, but even the thing that he performed, that, the performance was crazy. Like with yeah, the piano and shit, that, that shit was great. Uh, Are they relatable? Like the yeah, that's okay. and that's another thing. It's super relatable. Okay. I'm like they, they have same struggles as us. Yeah. Exact same struggle. Yeah, I just like I said, I it's feel just like about Pat. style. Yeah, that's what it's gonna come down. I'm to. telling you, style. And if, if he, he got bars, he, I'm talking about he witty with. I'm telling this you, this morning my tea was too hot. <laughs> to like pop, pop, put it in I'm not gonna lie, even pop. when Stormzy was rapping <laughs> and he was like, "I let the rain fool." I was like, "What rain fool?" Who's running? Oh, fall, fall. Oh, uh, no. He said, like, oh. Oh. He, Yeah, he's a fool. He's a rain fool. And I was like, I, I, was I don't like, know. I'm just a fan. I watched Top Boy. Top Boy and I watched, was really and good. And I thought I wasn't going to like Top Boy because of that. But, but I was like, is that like I the really British got into Top Boy. Top Boy is fine. Yeah. Your accent racist. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Your accent racist. No, no, because I love the British accent. But when they try to do the. <laughs> it's the tough it's part. The t- it's yeah, just it's the, the tough that, part. That don't, it's it, the vibe. Because, like, look, look. In, I mean, <laughs> there's some niggas money. in Atlanta. I don't understand what the fuck they're saying. Right? Definitely. I never know. I'm around his head when he's saying, We already say young thugs sound like your grandma. Yeah. Like, I don't understand what the accent is. Completely. When something sounds funny, it sounds funny. Yeah. You just can't say it don't sound funny. <laughs> but but at the same time, it sounds good. Yeah, it's sound like when Young Thug does his thing. Like I I I feel the vibe of it. Like he's, he's melodic. Yeah, I fuck with Young Thug. I, I fuck with Young Thug, but he's melodic as hell. Yeah, mm-hmm. uh, but the it does British funny. guys, it just doesn't. Yeah, he's melodic. It doesn't have that like they hella have their melody voice. though. They huh? do. 
Mm-hmm. They got melody. They have melody. They got I melody. Every, they melody. I want, I'm just saying I want everyone listening to this, listen to Dave's Psycho Drama album, and you could. I'm going to listen to that. Send it on IG or tweet me how you feel about it. If you don't like it, you don't like it, I'm but listening. I challenge you just to listen to it. I'm going to listen to it. With an open I'm, mind. I'm listen to it for the, for the and, content of it. And listen that. to it while you're not doing anything. Listen to what like he's really saying. Really sit down like and listen sit to it. Sit down with it. Great right. album. All right. I fuck with it. And his name's Dave. I was just. Yeah, that's not good. since then, honestly. That's a good man. I feel like he's the Donald Glover of the UK. Like, he be acting, he's talented. He's okay. only twenty. I think he's only oh, like twenty. Oh, too young. Okay. Own style, like he's a, he's a beast. Hold on, that, that dude him. with the all black on was only twenty. No, no, that's no, no. Stormzy. The oh, first no, year, yeah, no, Stormzy about forty. Storm- no, I'm no, Stormzy. No, I'm he he twenty five. He like twenty five. Twenty four. Yeah, he just big. He big. Yeah. yeah. And they're gigantic. Well, he, the Stormzy guy, I don't know how. But I just wanted to, y'all to watch that show, The Range. Like, Stormzy oh, no, Range, he got an Afro pop song, that was introspective hard. Yeah. song. He got the grime song. That was like, Stormzy, even, but throughout the range, the talent. it's just the, the <laughs> I was just like, this is he good. He got the but, same voice throughout <laughs> all that range. I honestly <laughs> respect the music and like, like I, I like what they were doing. Yeah. Now, when we talking about blowing up, if like UK, like if it can translate, I it's just don't already think, translated. It definitely uh, translated. It, it has translated a bit, but it's like, can it ever overtake, you know, us I'm not know, saying like, now because it's, 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 it's probably going to be a long time. It's still time. young and it's in translating right, and blowing right, up right. stage, but those guys are talented. I no, would I, 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 they, they, like, they seem the really talented. British people are just taking over acting right now. Oh yeah, like, no, they, all the best actors are just they British. Got that. I yeah. think it's always been like that. You just didn't notice until now. It's probably, always maybe. been like that. Yeah, I don't know because all the movie stars used to be American movie stars. The blockbuster stars were American. Like the Will Smiths. Now it's just like British people just taking over. Is that just our cinema history though? Yeah, that's our set. Like I've never even like. Like looked over there until recently. No, I'm not talking about <laughs> what they produce. I'm just saying what we get here. Oh. Like oh, now oh, it's all British insane. actors that's here. Insane. I don't yeah. know what they make over gotcha. there. Gotcha. But I'm talking about like in the it used to be Tom Cruise or, yeah. or Harry, if you want to go further, Harrison Ford, all these American yeah. guys. No, it's also now it's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yeah, yeah. Now it's I don't just, think his accent but, is American at all. <laughs> yeah, but he was, was, but he was new too. in there. Classic he was Hollywood, new in yeah. there. Cla- now, classic Hollywood this, was like, I don't even think British. British people were allowed. <laughs> all the best actors elite. are British yeah. right now. Yeah. yeah. There's killing. some people that you still don't know British. Yeah. Because yeah. you haven't watched the interview. Yeah. I'm, I'm searching for that, though. Oh, That's sure. always yeah, an amazing sure. surprise. What's the last movie you watched? What's the last movie you watched? Just period? Yeah, that was like a new new movie. Uh, What have I seen recently? I don't know. I'll Joker is Joaquin Phoenix British? <laughs> is he? <laughs> no, he's not. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He seems like he would be low key British. Right, right, yeah. He'd be having weird interviews. Have you ever seen We Are the Millers? Yeah, you know the kid. That, the kid is British. Not, he's yeah, British. Yeah, I didn't know. And he's he's a, a great actor. Yeah, he's great. Yeah. You know he was what I'm talking Maze about? Runner. He was in We Are the Miller. Yeah, he's uh, a weird uh, looking dude. Yeah, his head. He was in big. that movie about uh, one of those movies about cops killing and black not, people. And, and also yeah. Detroit. The Detroit, Detroit, yeah. and also like a deep voice. Like when he went what? to talk, when he went to talk the first time, yeah, he yeah, had yeah. deep like Yo, so deep British voice. I want to forget. Did you see Queen and Slim? No. You didn't see that? Well, the girl in there is British. And the dude. And the dude. Yep. And, well, yeah, we know he's British. Right? Yeah. I feel like there's an uptick. That was a surprise, in, too, though. I feel like there's an uptick in black British actors. Gotcha. Especially. Yeah, yeah. Like, you see, you know, like you said, Idris. Snowfall. Uh, Snowfall. Well, Dame, yeah, Snowfall. Dame, yeah, Snowfall. Dame, yeah, Dame, you Dame got Snowfall, the, yeah. uh, uh, what's the girl that was in Black Mirror? She's also in Black Panther. Oh. Um, um, you know, black Panther's British. Yeah, yeah. No, he's not. Oh, oh, oh. No. Chadwick? Then played the little, bro- play little sister. Not with that hair he got. Who played the little sister? Huh? Who played the little sister? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but a lot of these people that y'all are, they were in Top Boy. A lot of these people were in Top yeah. Boy. So I knew. I was like, yeah, he's British. I guess right, I should right, watch right. Top Boy then. No, the British Top shows. Good. Top Boy's good. Top right. Boy's great. Yeah, Top Boy's good. I give you that. How many seasons deep is it, though? Well, they, like. this this new season that's on Netflix is technically the third yeah. season, but okay, if you've never cool. seen it, you can watch you can it. They'll tell you. That's but that's fine. The first and two seasons only like six episodes. It's hard for me to get into shows that they're like, I'm, I'm on season seventeen. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Just start, yeah, yeah, you right? start, <laughs> I can't. You like, start straight from easy. Netflix. Like, <laughs> yeah. It's good fine. too. Yeah, it is good. It's good. It's good. All right, y'all. Uh, Pat, man, thank you for coming. At, uh, yeah, that's that's it, man. Let, let the people, yeah, yeah, let the people know where they can find on, you. What you got going on? Uh, man, just Pat, follow me, Patrick Cloud, on everything. Make sure you watch uh, All Deaf. We got new shows coming out, and um, yeah, just follow my channel separately too. <laughs> is it, give me a it's about time for another uh, Dormtainment Dad jokes. Yes, it should be. About we the, might need to come in the classroom, man. I kind of want to go in the classroom. Can I go in the classroom? Oh, I kind of want to go in the classroom. You roast? Yeah. You want hey, to go? Nigga, get, get over with the minute. Y'all ain't trying to go as you know, a group? Roasting, roasting ain't necessarily my strength. I will let the... let the. I know my strength. I know Kev said they wanted to come on. Was it a new show that Kev do? Or were y'all... 
it's not great taste, but it's kind of like great where y'all discussing other stuff. I forgot what it's called. Oh, I, the, the squad cast. Yeah, 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 that, yeah, that, yeah, absolutely. yeah. That'd be yeah, cool. That'd be, yeah, tight, that'd be cool. Um, he's on you guys would be good season at that. two of Room Noise, and he's on season yes, two. We just, yeah, we yeah. just had him on season two Room Noise. Hey, what, should we I say like the topic the yet, or should we hold? No, it? We'll, we'll, we'll hold it. We'll hold it. But it's good. The song came out good. Season two dropping. Like end of March, beginning of April. Yeah. So, all right, y'all. Well, thank you for tuning in to another episode of the Comedy Trap House. We'll see you next week. Peace. Yeah.